Good day, viewers. Welcome to another episode of this, my daddy's book, Women Are Tools of Restoration. My name still remains Opi Udeze, you are regular host. Today, on this book, we'll be treating a wonderful topic titled, Understanding the Role of Women in the Move of God. Anytime there is need for new move of God, women play a very important role because they wear the face of the earth they are not usually neglected in the affairs of the earth both god and satan use women to exercise dominion on earth satan was given access to corrupt and introduce death into the lives and destinies of men through eve and god depended on mary to produce jesus christ the savior of the world if the destiny of the last millennium must be established, women must play a major role. The coming of the Lion of Judah is principally in the hand of women. If the ancient rules must be repaired according to prophecy, women must play a vital role. Neglecting women in this season is mocking what the season is all about. The friendly and submissive nature of women to divinity is the main reason why God will always need them in difficult times. Because of the eternal love women have for God, they are mostly used to accomplish extraordinary feats. The devotion of women to God makes it possible for them to be used to accomplish extraordinary feats. They are sweet servers of life to those that must live and servers of death to those that must die. Every woman is a tool of miracle. Women are miracle themselves. Women proffer solution in times of crisis. The answer to every difficult puzzle is with women. Women have large hearts. Large hearts will always believe the impossible. God uses women to solve difficult problems. Women are irreplaceable in solving very difficult problems. Women have ability to act on behalf of God. The greatest ability that is made available to all men is the power to believe the word of God. God created women because he believes in their great ability. Women have the ability to change the course of history. When God wanted to deal with the Philistine, he depended on the mother of Samson to raise a powerful judge in the ancient Israel. Prodigious children will always pass through consecrated wombs. What God will give us is controlled by what he gets from us. Our readiness determines what God accomplished through us. Future is apprehended through preparation. The earth puts on a new look each time God raises unique women. This last millennium is looking for consecrated wombs. The uniqueness of the prophetic ministry of Jeremiah and the awesomeness of the apostolic ministry of Paul we are all attributed to all that happened in the wombs of their mother. The consecration of visionary wombs is not usually denied. The story of the redemption of man cannot be told without focusing on Mary. God depended solely on Mary to produce the human value of Jesus. God will use us to accomplish extraordinary things if we keep ourselves. Women are made in a way that they can serve any divine purpose because they are tremendously hooked to glory. Sometimes Satan finds them a helpful tool. May it not be our portion in the name of Jesus. Amen. The role of women cannot be overlooked if there must be leverage from all forms of problems. Wow, it's nice talking to you. We have come to the end of today's episode from this wonderful book, Women Have the Power of Restoration. It's nice talking to you. I will see you same time next week. If you want a copy of this My Daddy book, click on the WhatsApp column below the comment section and you will get yours. Thank you. Bye. Love you plenty.